This is how you greet your superior officer, soldier? I knew you'd come. Ah, I figured I might as well spend the last day in the country with my little brother. Are you nervous? Nah. Someone has to win this war. I bet my boots I can hit all five with five bullets. Uh, tempting. Are fist fights part of your training program now? You should have seen the other guy. Yeah, I heard. You sent him to the hospital. So what did he do, kiddo? Whatever. Well, if it's about a girl, she better be worth it. Just remember, you're worrying mom with that stuff. You need to be the man of the house when I'm gonna be in Afghanistan. Ah, I can already smell the dinner from here. Don't get me wrong, the army feeds us all right, but damn, I've missed mom's good old chicken wings. Remember how we played hide and seek here? <laughs> Hard to forget. You were really bad at it. <laughs> I remember once when we... Rob? Come on, Rob. <laughs> Rob? Okay, brother. Let's see what you got. ETA, two minutes, boys. Really? Uh, shut up! You still using it to beat yourself up, Walter boy? Hanging yourself on a bent, tarnished cross? A very poetic, Rob. At least I have a sense of right and wrong. Oh, the system's rigged, brother. Some guys get slammed for no reason, some guys get hyped for no reason. Is it bitter and lonely not to believe in anything? You're the perfect soldier, John. Naive, gullible, brainwashed, chain of command, following orders. Yes, sir. Hey! You believe in the system when it suits you! Big church wedding, Marine Honor Guard, Mila took your name! That was all her! Yeah, but you played along like a good little soldier! How would you know? You weren't even there, but thanks for the lovely gift! Oh wait, you didn't ever send a fucking car! Uh, she's wrong for you, Robert! Says the man whose longest relationship lasted, what, six months? Is it bitter and lonely being such a self-righteous prick? Final approach, guys. Ready. Ready. Try not to kill each other out there. I don't want to break the news to Mama North. Don't go rogue! Don't be a robot. I'm serious. She scares the shit out of me. And she scares the shit out of everybody! Which is how she raised such badass warrior sons. Well, one of them. Eh, yeah, not hard to figure which it's one. It's on you two. Destroy the bioweapon and exfiltrate. Get it out. No sniffing around. It's Cold War vintage, so who knows what toxic shit is in there. Okay. Three, two, one, go! Hoorah! This is it. The Russian-Ukrainian border. Not sure what I was expecting. Com check. Frank, can you hear me? Over. Loud and clear. Listen up, Marines. JSOC needs you to infiltrate that abandoned military complex and destroy its bioweapon stockpile. Stay frosty. Over and out. Over and out. After you, Rob. You should have a better view from up there. Roger that. What's that? No fucking idea. Test site, maybe? All right, let's have a look. Fuck, can't see shit. We're too far. We need to find a better spot. What about over there? Cliffs on the right side of that dome. You see that? Yeah, I see it. Not sure about the angle, though. 
Let's go and check it out. Careful. The rocks might be slippery. After you. Always first. Hey, you're the one holding the Navy Cross. I didn't fight for that. Yeah, yeah. Just go. We don't have all day. See that? Piece of cake. Good job. Right. I'm on the other side. So am I. Come on. Time's in short supply. A fucking ghost town over there. Too quiet for your taste? In our line of work, quiet never means safe. Remember the times that it'd be your first idea. <laughs> yeah. What now? Let me have a look around. Well, damn. Nice work, brother. You're going first. Careful. Yeah, I know. Chill. Feels solid. Yeah, it looks like they're coming closer. Stay low. Up the path. Better be safe. Okay, let's go. Quick, behind that rock. I have a bad feeling about this. Bad feeling, huh? Wolves. Told you I had a bad feeling. Believe me now? You were right this time. Looks like they're busy chewing down something. No need to kill them until you really have to. Let's go through the bushes. Okay, go. Stay low. They could attack us. Don't think so. They're focused on the carrion. Right. I found some footprints. They look fresh. Whoever left those can't be far away. Is that all? You're the tracker in this family. What can you tell? Military boots. Two men. Must be soldiers. Army? Mercenaries? Scouts? Uh, judging by their pattern, they're organized. And by their depth, I'd say they were carrying some heavy shit. You mean weapons? That's a safe bet. We should be ready for the worst. Shit. I guess it's time for us to get to work. Stay frosty. Don't get carried away. I have eyes on the test site. Two mercenaries in there. We're gonna take them by surprise. I'll take that fucker at the edge and you focus on the one by the fire. Let's go. <coughs> I 
kill for a warm meal. That was easy. There'll be more of them. Be alert. Yeah, look at that. What a wreck. Here, take it. Here, it's the drone. Time for the recon. You know how to use this beauty, don't you? I'm pretty sure I'll figure it out. First, you need to tag all the enemies. Got the first one. This is a perfect position for support. Yeah, I know what to do. Remember, John, quiet. We need to take them one by one before they realize we're here. Let's concentrate, old boy. First target, up on the roof, 270 meters. Watch me, brother. Tango located on the roof, 180 meters away. Ah, stop moving. Tango down. Kill confirmed. Third target, patrol, 160 meters away, near the stream. Wait for the opportunity. Come on, show yourself. You're covered by trees. Steady, steady. They're spreading out. Target down. Confirmed. Second one. 160 meters away. Dead. Very dead. Fifth target. 200 meters. Wait. A vehicle to come. Sixth target located. I need you to concentrate. You're only going to get a single shot off, so make it count. Follow me, brother. So, where's your wife these days? Iraq? Turkey? Mila? She's in the Congo, doing a piece about this local warmonger. Yeah, I heard about it. Special Forces is discussing bombing that motherfucker. You worried? Nah, she's tough as nails. She only looks fragile. A vehicle incoming. I see the driver inside. Ah, 
Leave it to me. Wait, he might know something. I'm on the spot. Yes, I've got the cargo. We'll bring it to you in a moment. Uh, no, we didn't meet. They were supposed to wait for me in here. Okay, we'll check that out. One false move and you're dead. How many of you? Four. Inside. Good job. Feel like any other. It reminds me of my days in the Navy. Stay focused, Rob. All right, all right. We're coming in. Copy. This place used to serve as a biological weapons test area. You have to blow that whole shit up. Roger. Got it. Intruder detected. Fucking cameras! Ah, they know we're here. No point in trying to be quiet now. All right, let's do some good. Come on, move on. Come on. Watch me, brother. Yeah, yeah, show me what you got. Good job, brother. Anytime. Yeah. What about you, John? Wasn't there anyone in Afghanistan? What about her? Leah was her name. Lydia. So why didn't you two... Leave it, Rob. Okay then, forget I asked. Use the CCTV. We're gonna beat them at their own game. Now, tag all the enemies in here. All marked? Let's go! Brad, that's the entrance to the landfill. Our target must be somewhere nearby, John. Let's move. Charges here. You do remember how to do that, brother. Covering the door. Hurry up, John. Mercenaries, open fire. Come on, John. The chopper's here. What the fuck? Drop your weapons. Drop them. You know, Mr. North, I believe the best of us are also lucky. One, two. Until next time, Mr. North, don't kill him.
JSOC headquarters. We're sending you coordinates to the nearest safe house. There you'll find equipment and mission information. Good luck, Marine. JSOC yeah. over and out. Yeah. What do you need? Oh my god, I'm gonna lose my mind with this music. Lodestar. Come in, Lodestar. This is Whiskey, Foxtrot Sierra. What? Frank? You're on this line? Making sure you don't go off the reservation. Hey, I'm fine and dandy, just doing my job. Look, man. I'm sorry about your brother. Okay. So where are we? HQ didn't brief you? Yeah, they did. But I want to hear it from you. Okay, Whiskey Foxtrot Sierra, sir. Big uptick in Separatist activity in this part of Georgia. Situation very unstable. HQ is right about that. But these guys are better trained and have more sophisticated arms than we usually see in this kind of operation. It's building something big. Whoever's leading them is one kick-ass motherfucker. Oh, and did I mention crazy smart and feared like a god? So we need to sow a legion chaos in amongst these troublemakers. Show them what it really means. Stealth and all. Copy that. You'll find all the details about the missions on your laptop. First one is already there, Marine. This is a secure and encrypted line. No need for old code names and other secret squirrel bullshit. Just fucking with you, Lodestar. Sims out. Out. Intel says he's the butcher of Borjami. Wipe that village clean, then burn it to the ground. About 1,500 dead. I've got 1,500 Georgian Lari. That's what? 40 cents to the dollar? I'd like to nail the bills to that son of a bitch's chest and write payment for Borjami across his face. Yeah, that would make it crystal clear. That you kill innocent civilians, you got a price on your head. Copy that. Priority two? Gunrunner. Igor Zaitsev. Wages of sin or death. Just like the good book says. Marked with chapter and verse. We don't know exactly when Zaitsev is arriving, so you might want to set up an observation point on the hills not far from there. Stealth and awe. Copy. Out. I'm on site. Copy. Get comfy. I'll keep you informed. Okay, get ready. You got some time before the target arrives. Use your scopes to scout the area. Multiple tangos in the vicinity. Copy. Look around and remember to hold your fire before the target arrives. Roger. They've got a mortar. Seems like they're ready for us. Too many guards there right now. Stay low. I see a sniper nest above the checkpoint. They're all well-trained and dangerous bastards. It may be a good idea to take him down before the situation gets hot. Your call. I think I got him. The guy looks like Kovac. Fits the description. Waiting for confirmation? Confirmed. It's Kovac.
target's dead. Confirmed. Exfiltrate the area. Confirmed, Lodestar. Was touch and go until I got a clean sight line. Good job. Eyes like a hawk. Thanks. Think I should earn a little leeway. Intel reports a couple of sightings of Robert. John. He's my brother. Request denied, soldier. He's not in our deck of cards. <sighs> I know. You cool with that? Yeah, I'm cool. Keep focused, John. You've got enough trouble directly ahead. We've got a ghost presence in the safe house. Movement detectors are throwing up shadows. How many? Could be three or four. An ambush? Or a raid. Could be that location is blown. Fuck. We've got a big weapons cache, maps, recent intel. Get over there. But be careful. They gotta know you're coming. Good. Never been afraid of ghosts. Out. Long time no see. Yeah, it's been... That's for the shit you pulled in Afghanistan. Point taken. Now would be the perfect time to tell me why I'm here. I've been ordered to destabilize the Separatist cells and neutralize their leadership. I won't lie. I need someone who knows the region. <laughs> you better be fucking joking. I thought I made it clear. I'm never working for your government again. Perfectly clear. There's the real reason. It's Robert. He's here. Robert? Oh, Robert. So you called me here to go chasing ghosts with you. You know I'm a wanted person in Georgia, right? Over the past six weeks, CIA, BND, and Mossad have all identified a man fitting Robert's description in northern Georgia. That's it? Jesus, John. You took this assignment because you think he's here, didn't you? Robert's my brother, Lydia. He's family. What do you need me to do? You know this region better than anyone. You're a hell of a fighter. I know I can trust you. What happened between us in Afghanistan, that was a long time ago. I don't know if it still means anything to you, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry I was me and that it hurt you. You unbelievable fucking asshole. Deal. I'll help you find your goddamn little brother. I'll hit up a few contacts. Let them know I'm back in the game. I'll be seeing you, Marine. Another day in paradise. Come in, Lodestar. Ah, oh, come on, Lydia. Not you too. Sweetness and light on the outside, total shit on the inside. But you are a badass killing machine, so... Maybe that's what it takes. <clears throat> so, let's get to it then. Thomas and David Sidemonidze started to unify all the separatist cells. As ever, when brutal ethnic cleansing starts, it brings haters together. There is an emerging Georgian resistance snapping away at the edges of the separatist campaign. In short, sabotage. It's causing disruption. Not very strong, but with a lot of heart. What's key to bringing them over? A humanitarian mission. Civilians are being marched to an old cemetery. They're being executed by the separatists. Save them. Resistance intel can help lead us to Thomas and David. It'll be my pleasure. Out. Be careful out there. Target's down. Copy. Roger. Be on the lookout for enemy movement. The area is clear. You can make a break for it. Oh, please. We will never forget what you've done for us. Lydia. Lydia, do you copy? I got you, John. Good work. 
fucking heartbreaking. People led to the slaughter like cattle. But thanks to you, they'll live to fight another day. And you've already hit major intel pay dirt. The Rodki Lions have come to us. Their leader, Kobo Nimsadze, gave us Avon Khrushchev. He's another separatist top lieutenant. Vicious, sadist, pure evil. But nothing on Tomas or David? That intel will come. I know Kobo will be very useful. He's one of the strongest, most committed resistance leaders. Very easy on the eyes, too. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Let us just keep moving up the spine of the snake. According to Koba, you can find Khrushchev in the blocks. I'm guessing that's one of those Soviet buildings that looks like a prison. But this one is an apartment building. Crumbling, old, supposedly abandoned. Watch your step. Could be booby-trapped. Thanks, I... Save it. Can't afford to lose a valuable asset like you on the ground. Yeah, right. Out. John, wait. Koba offered his support in searching for clues on Robert. You did good, John. Out. Got some new intel for me? New category of targets. The most wanted list. The most dangerous separatist monsters out there. We're talking horrific war crimes. JSOC wants them to dispense with where and when we find them. What about the ICC? This is American justice. Shoot first, ask questions later. Yeah, well, I've seen separatist handiwork in the field, so I don't have any questions. Torture and killing of POWs, rape and burning civilians alive. First target on the most wanted list is Ivan Khrushchev. Ivan Khrushchev, yeah. Rodki Lyons said I could find him in the blocks. New intel has him moving around the complex. He's deeply paranoid and always travels with a heavy escort. No fancy footwork, John. In and out quickly. Do as much damage as you can and head home. Will do. Out. Easy to sneak into the building. Try to find the other way. Maybe you can take him out from a distance. Good job. Mission accomplished. You're almost too good at this. Thanks, I think. No, I'm serious. The Separatists are spooked by your efficiency. They've figured out there is a new gun in town. Not sure they have your name yet. JSOC has picked up some local chatter about you. You're getting quite the reputation. And in the chatter, we heard a mention of a satellite comms facility in the mountains. Christ. If we could hack in there, we'd have the Separatists by the short hairs. You got it, Marine. And JSOC will get their intel. Wait for the details. Out. Got more on the satellite comms? Yeah. JSOC wants you to redirect the broadcast signal. Manually? We've got an approximation of the plans. You'll have to reposition the radio telescopes. That it? It's no cakewalk, John. You'll have to infiltrate the heavily guarded <laughs> antenna array. This is a key facility for them. They'll quickly catch on about what happened, but before they do, we'll access all of their archives. There's likely to be some chatter about Robert. All I can promise is to keep our ears open. He may not even be alive. Nah, Frank. He's too stubborn to die. Please. All right. Ears open, John. Out. Frank, I have a visual. 
along the base. The primary target are the radio telescopes. Make your way inside and reposition them to the coordinates I've uploaded to your tablet. Be careful with your drone. If you fly it too close to the dishes, their signals will interfere with its frequency. Uploading the coordinates to the first antenna. Nice work. Now find the other towers. We need all of them for this to work. Holy shit, John. That was too close. All right. Double time for the next dish and let's get the fuck out of here. That's all of them. Nice job, John. Take a breather. But don't slack off on me yet. We still have a lot of work ahead of us. Well done, John. Any chatter about Robert? It's going to take a while to sort through and decrypt that. Nothing on your brother. But we hit the mother load on a nearby train yard. There's a train yard nearby in the region. That's the one. It's being rebuilt as a major transportation hub. The Separatists are shipping something big. It's not just an arms depot for smuggled weapons extra gear? Could be. We've had chatter about Russia, Turkey, China, and Saudi Arabia redirecting shipments this way. But there's something much bigger at stake. That takes some serious financial backing. Someone is funding the Separatists as a front for a much larger endgame. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. We've got to take out that hub. I'll turn that train yard into a junkyard. Twisted metal and matchstick railroad ties. JSOC will search the communications logs. If Robert's out there, someone's gotta be talking about him. Focus on the train yard, and I'll keep an ear out here. Thanks. Out. Chatter about this rebuilt rail transport hub. Key strategic location to widen the Separatist reach. Gives them agility and increased strike capacity. Any intel on that special payload they're expecting? No. Just that it's a game changer. That's why we need you to infiltrate the yard and get the shipping manifests. We need to know who's shipping what and why. Damn. I was hoping for fireworks. Well, Intel says the Separatists have been stockpiling fuel in a load of on-site tanker cars. Enough to send the whole rail yard kaboom. Uh, that would do in the fireworks department. All it takes is a single spark. And you, pal, are a fucking blowtorch. I'll do my best. Out. I've got the manifest. Copy that. Now dump the fuel from those tanker cars. I've released the second valve. Things are going to get really hot once you light the fire. So be damn sure you're away from there when you strike the match. Shipping from... Russia. Handwritten notes from David mentions a Flostov. One of the heads of our double-headed snake. Yeah. David and Thomas. Biggest, baddest Separatist leaders. Slithering around a lethal cell that should be named Cancer. So who's Flostov? Russian? Right. Some scientist. Now here's the really interesting part. As soon as Flostov's name came up, Mossad came down on us hard. Seems they're also looking for this guy. Is Mossad gonna be a help or a hindrance here? That's what you're going to find out, John. You've got a meet and greet in a nearby region. Somewhat neutral territory, if any place in this godforsaken area is neutral. 
I'll see what's up. Is there anything more I should know? No, John. Sorry. No further intel on Robert. Jesus Christ, where is he? Knowing him, he's hiding in plain sight, the sneaky bastard. He's good at what he does. And that's what will keep him alive. I'm doing everything I can, John. I know. But JSOC Priority is analyzing everything we got on David and Thomas Sidemanitsa. You go get the lowdown on this flow stuff. And try to play nice with the Mossad agent. Only if Mossad plays nice with me. Out. Walk, Mr. North. What the? I'll be tracking your movements. Excuse me? I'll kill him. Out. Was that a joke? So if we don't act quickly... About damn time, John. John North, I'm pleased to finally meet you in the flesh. It's nice to finally put a face to the voice. Likewise, Mr. North. But you're more magnetic on the radio, to be honest. And you are? Lydia, ex-Georgian SFB. Hmm. So, why are you helping us? Mr. Sims has brought me up to speed on your fight against the Separatists. I believe we can serve each other's interests. I'm looking for a man. He's a high-priority target for Mossad. Who? Dr. Sergei Flostov. If you help me locate him, I will assist you in your efforts against the Separatists. As well as in other... activities. You have yourself a deal. What's the plan, Frank? If we can eliminate the leadership of these cells while they're disorganized, they'll eventually collapse under their own weight. It's not a walk in the park, however. Thomas Sidamonitsa and Ina Zakarayan are the leaders of the two strongest Separatist cells operating in Georgia. They're also about to be wed. If they manage to merge their forces, the Separatists will become a real threat to the sitting government. So, we pop one of them and make it look like a setup? Let them take each other out after? You read my mind. JSOC has already signed off on neutralizing Sidemanitsa. But where? The wedding is being held in Kozori in two days' time. I grew up near Kozori. I could sketch a city map. Good. You go on ahead and find a spot to scope the target. I'm on it. It's a wedding, so make sure there's a clear line of sight of the church. I know I can trust you, Lydia. Keep an open comm channel. Got it. Tick tock. Of course, Mr. North. This wedding is going to be big. Everyone will be off their heads drunk or getting there. But you do need to blend in, John. Fuck blending in. I suggest you go as someone everyone will cheer. The driver of the delivery truck bringing in more wine. That's a bit balls out. Thank you. They buying your disguise, Lydia? You okay? Somewhat of a minor hero, actually. Dishonorable discharge from the Georgian army goes a long way here. So what exactly did you do? Put a general out of commission along with a dozen Georgian soldiers. Fucking looters and savages. The separatists don't know that, just my kill count. You'd do well to sell some cigarettes or oxy. Any pills you can get your hands on, Lydia. Everyone's got a side hustle going. War is good for business. And business is a great disguise. I'm too- Right, on the spot. See the villa. Good. First you'll have to find the keys to the truck. How am I gonna do that? They could be anywhere. You tell me. You're the special ops guy here. Maybe ask one of those douchebags. Oh, and maybe you should drop that military look before you get to Kazori. I just got the information that the leader of that criminal group is in the Widery right now. So if you're feeling somewhat heroic today, you could take him down while you're there. Does that help our cause? Not directly, but the workers will definitely appreciate the change in management. I'm changed. Right. Find the truck. Got the truck. No. I need to make a small detour first. What? Where to? The city's heavily guarded, remember? I need to hide my equipment. Or your cover will be compromised. Gotcha. I've hidden my equipment. I'll be in Kazori in a few minutes. That's 
what I wanted to hear. What? Where are you going? What do you have here? Wine? For the wedding? And I'm late. You see? Oh yeah, we were expecting the delivery. But we didn't expect it to be delivered by an American. Why is this? He seems to be telling the truth. There's a lot of wine in the truck. No sign of anything suspicious. Mm. Okay, you can drive in. Groom arrived yet? The guy is first on the scene. I'm here to do a job. That doesn't mean talking. I thought we patched things over. I fucking waited for you. I'm a shithead. An asshole. A fucked up piece of scum. Right on all counts. I didn't deserve you. I couldn't... Oh, spare me. It's the truth. So you disappear? You leave me waiting like a lovesick fool? Twelve of my men died that night, Lydia. I remember every name, every face, my whole MEU. Soldiers died, John. We know the risks. It's not your fault. It was on my watch. Stop. I'm way too fucking mad to feel sorry for you. So they pin a medal on me to cover up that massive intel failure. It was a lie. It made everything about me a lie. How could I look anyone, you, in the face? I was going to ask you to marry me. Fuck you, John. I would have said yes. Hey, wake up. We have a job to do. Ah, shit. We overslept. The streets are probably already crawling with soldiers. You're here as a civilian, remember? They won't recognize you. Maybe... Oh, what an optimist. Either way, I'll still need a weapon to kill the target, and I doubt they'll give me one of theirs. Don't worry, I'm not gonna try to kill anyone in the middle of a church. It's best we strike tonight, while they're drunk and disorganized. <laughs> Beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. For Georgia! For in hell, monster! Come on, come on. Get your American ass out of here. But I... Shut up. I know a cave just south of here. Get out or be suspect number one.
Okay, I'm sending John. The body is in HQ. Just a few guards. Most of the separatists are gathered in the restaurant, where the cell leaders are busy infusing one another. Ina is gone. This should give us some time to investigate. We need to know who that other sniper was. Fuck. They're here. Persistent little fuckers. All right. They're down. Nice. Just remember that we don't want to start an open war here. We can't afford to have civilians caught in the crossfire. I won't make false promises. Not to you. That's sweet, but just be careful. Oh, holy hell is breaking out. Interrupted wedding caused quite a ruckus. <coughs> yeah. Groom's brain splat all over a church tends to do that. What's next, Chief? We're still untangling the encrypted satellite comms. Combing through for juicy details. Robert? Not yet. Fuck. There's a lot of separatist chatter about an elite unit operating in the area. Lots of warnings to avoid getting in their way. I've heard a few nervous whispers. No one seems to know their objective. They're like ghosts, inspiring terror and then vanishing again. We've only got one name. A mystery man named Armazi. Spoken of rarely and only with dread. <laughs> like the guy has superpowers. Robert was captured by an elite unit. Could these guys be connected? God, I hope not. They're the worst of the worst. Fuck. Yeah. Out. What else can I expect in the HQ? If they manage to make any notes on the assassination, it should be on one of their hard drives. Got it. I'm inside. The body should be in the basement lab. Ground patrols and at least two vehicles. No other. I've got the ballistic report. I see. Anything peculiar? The bullet nearly ripped his head off. 50 cal? Maybe. I won't learn much here. I'm sending you the data. That's it. Get back. No. One more stop. I want to check the church. <laughs> Weird moment for conversion, but suit yourself. According to the documents from the autopsy, the bullet was strange and... deformed? Strange how? No details. The bullet hit him like a sledgehammer, threw him all the way here. There's a bullet hole in the floor. I found a fresh hole in the wall, two inches thick. That's crazy. Do you know a bullet that could do that? Some 50 cals could, or maybe Teflon bullets. It had to be a damn good rifle. Outside. Fields, hills, forest, ruins. At least a dozen decent sniping spots. Okay. If I were to take a shot like that, I'd 
Choose this ruined church on the hill. Shit, I already know how this went. I'm going to the church. <sighs> Go on then. Keep me informed. I'm at the church on the hill. Look around carefully. If this really was his sniping spot, then he must have left something. Anything. I've been doing this my whole life. Trust me. I know what to do. There is some commotion by the church. Think they might have found what we did? I'll hurry up, don't worry. <clears throat> I found the casing. And? I've never seen anything like it. I think he left it here on purpose. He took the shot from this spot. Quite a rifle he must have. Clearly a pro. How do you know? He must have been here at least seven hours, laying on the ground, waiting. No trace of piss or excrement. Nothing. He's special ops, but luckily I found a trail. I'm going after him. Negative. Separatists are on their way. There's no time. I'm going, Lydia. Okay, I see a glint, reflection, package on a tombstone. Careful. Bomb? Roundish. Odd. Shit, it's a helmet. I... I think. What? A helmet is a helmet. An amazing technology. Not sure how it works. If you wanted me dead, I would be. It's a message. The ghost is real, Lydia. And steps ahead of us. Where are you hiding, brother? Was it that hard? I can see you! I see you picked up some new tricks! You give up? Not today.
I'm fine. Walk straight into a trap, but I'm fine. You need to get out. The Separatists are coming. I'm on my way. It is a mozzie, and some damn super sniper shoots it out of my hands. It makes no fucking sense. Jizak is still trying to get a handle on him. All I know is that whispers of this Armazi guy has grown into this crazy urban legend. Some people say he's a part machine. Some say he's like the reincarnation of the ancient pagan god, Mithras. Ah, bullshit. He may be extraordinarily well trained, but he's a soldier. Just using ultra high tech weaponry is all. I've collected one of his bullets. Nothing I've ever seen before. I got a guy. Glad to hear it. Shut up. A guy who specializes in out of the ordinary weaponry. Experimental, cutting edge stuff. I'll show it to him. See what he has to say. Much appreciated. He hasn't been seen in a while. He tends to disappear like fucking asshole men do. Okay, Lydia. Can you track him down? I've got an idea or two. Out. I'm really concerned, Frank. Avaz has gone missing. Intel says there's a deal going down between the criminal gang leaders and the Separatists. In some medieval ruins. In the mountains? Yeah. That would probably be the ancient church of Saint Simon. Now mostly a collection of boulders and broken carvings. But Avas won't be a part of any deal or any meeting. Because? Too much integrity. He's a real patriot. He never worked for the Separatists. They're using his name. We're using him. Someone in the meeting must know more. I know those mountains from childhood. I'll stay in touch with John. If they have of us, it's against his will. Be careful. Out. Ah, steep cliffs. Can't say I don't enjoy a challenge. You know, I rather like you when you're angry. Uh, like before the wedding? Don't count on it happening again. I think I got it out of my system. Ah, good. Yeah, all the better to focus on Amazi. I don't get why he let me live. He had a perfect shot. Ah, maybe he just made a mistake. <clears throat> People do make mistakes, you know? Georgian proverb. The tall one wouldn't bend, the short one wouldn't stretch. And the kiss was lost. Let's just find Avaz. Maybe he has some answers about Armazi. Remember, don't trigger the alarm. Otherwise, we won't have any chance to investigate that little piece of shit. in our deck. Most wanted. Do the world a favor, John, and take down that scum. We'll see. Remember, first we need to see what's going on. Try to overhear their conversation, will you? Okay, let's get this moving, people. I need to make a call. And what were they talking about? I was too general. I think they were discussing business. Lieutenant Drogan is down. Good job. You 
made the world a slightly better place. <clears throat> what the? Amazi, tell me what you know. Uh, I never talked with him. He and his 23 society goons just took the gear from Vasilisk and left. That's all I know. That's all I want to know. In DeVos. Vasilisk has him in the quarry. Is he alive? Yes. Vasilisk has him. Pretends Ava still runs the business. I better find him in one piece. <laughs> Fuck! What happened? John? Did you find something? Avas is at the quarry imprisoned by Vasilisk. You sure? Yeah. This little fucker here spilled all the beans. Look, Avas has been dethroned. Seems like that bastard Vasilisk got impatient to take the reins. Is Avas still in the quarry? He's unhurt, is he? I'll go do some recon. Great. Out. Wait. What? Zara mentioned this group, 23 Society. Keeps coming up. You know anything about these guys, Frank? Wrong, and intel guys blame it on 23 society. Like the boogeyman. But Zara, big bad dude, says he met with them. Says he met Amazi. Looked like he was going to piss his pants just saying the name. Zara is batshit crazy. I wouldn't trust a word he says. Out. Vasilisk. Where do I begin? Explosive, unstable, seemingly indispensable. Weird combination. He's the kind of guy who every time you turn around has exactly what you need. Knife, <clears throat> beer, length of chain, blanket, uncanny. Kind of creepy, actually. So Avas trusts this guy? Avas is no fool. He knows how dangerous Vasilisk is. But he is very useful. Became Avas's right-hand man, despite Vasilisk's little hobby. This just keeps getting better and better. Yeah. He'd throw his enemies in a pit and then cover them in cement. Oh, thanks. I'm so looking forward to meeting this maniac. The bookie can tell you where to find Vasilisk. He's got a lowdown on everything going on at the quarry, but the bookie would sell out his grandmother if the price was right. Don't trust him. Don't trust anyone in that godforsaken sinkhole. Hope at least the booze is good. Out. A Vas's life is on the line. If you raise an alarm, Vasilisk may panic and kill him. I'm looking for the man at the top. The very top. I'm running a business here. You want my time? You got a bet just like everyone else. Eh, fine. You're lucky I'm not in the mood to make a scene. Yet. Your lucky day, good buddy. Step right here. Oh, what the hell are you doing? Get that guy! 
What? You won. I've played your little game, now talk. Where can I find Avas? He likes to keep a close eye on the business, you know? Where is Avas? Well, I honestly have no idea. You like betting, huh? Let's bet on how many punches I give you before you have permanent brain damage. Wait, what? Hey, you're a big guy. I'm thinking between 30 and 40. Okay, talk with Madame Lee. She runs the brothel and she knows everything about everyone. Tell her I sent you and she won't be afraid to talk. Good. What was that, my friend? Baba Yaga tonight again. So, how about we go somewhere more? You feel a bit lonely, monsieur? I know what ails you, and I have the perfect remedy. You'll need a woman. Or two. Take your pick. I'm not interested in that. Bookie told me that you can help me. I'm looking for Avas. Honey, I'll tell you what. I'll set up a meeting with a friend who might know something. In the meantime, why don't you take a break? Relax. Thank you, ma'am, but... You know you want it. There's a bed upstairs. Very, very comfy. Find some company and enjoy yourself for a few hours. Where is Avas? There's someone who will know where Avas is. His right hand in business. I'm listening. My girls had a man, known as Vasilisk. He has been talking with some of the boys at the barracks about how old Avas is and ill-suited to lead the business right now. It's not enough. Maybe he knows something about Avas. It's over, Vasilisk. Let the old man go. I agree with the American. I really think you should listen to- Shut me. up. Okay. Mr. North, how lucky for us to meet again. Drop the weapon. You must be fucking kidding. It was worth a try. It seems you have me in a bit of a spot. So, how about we play a little game? Fuck your games. Jonathan, you don't get it. I'm in control. Now, there are three of us, and three rounds in this pistol. If the old man dies, you get to ask me all about Robert North. If you die, the old man walks. And you? I'll be dead. Of course, you could shoot me now and save the old man. But deep down, you want to know about your brother. Don't you? Exactly. Shall we begin? One. Congratulations, old man. You live to annoy another day. Two. That's twice now, Mr. North. Don't you think your luck has to run out sometime? Bye-bye! I'm sorry, but you don't get to play. Three. Grandpa, are you all right? Grandfather? Yes, my dear, yes. I am well. This is your grandfather? Yes. This old bastard is all I have. I am in your debt, friend. Anything I can do? Name your price. I need to know everything about Vasilisk and the people he's working with. Well, seeing as I am no longer in immediate danger, I'll be only too happy to help. But... Let's get out of here first. I haven't been outside for days. Avas has plenty of questions from Basilisk supporters and intel that will be very useful to us about the coup. But his agenda isn't our agenda. Yeah, 
We were not working for fucking Mossad. Even though our interrogation methods are far superior to yours? Even though you weren't fucking born in this region? Don't know all the players or the dead personal history here? Save your goddamn superiority for... Easy now. Lydia, you lead. But let Raquel jump in with an assist from time to time. <sighs> Thanks, John. But let's please keep the assistance to a minimum. Or what? You'll break my spine like you did your commanding officer? Accidents happen. Don't fuck up my chance to dig up the intel on Robert. Got it? She's got it. Right, Raquel? Anything you say, John. Out. An angel mission for you. Great. Could use a change of pace. Who am I covering? JSOC agent, operating in the area for undisclosed reasons. He's not going to fuck us up, is he? Nah. He's infiltrating a mining facility to gather intel. Kid's a bit green. First solo mission. <clears throat> Could use some backup. Yeah, we've all been there. Yeah. Sometimes seems like a hundred years ago. Maybe to you, old timer. Feels like I'm just getting started. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that, John. Just give the kid a protective shield if he needs one. Get there, find a proper nest, and keep him alive until he's finished. Out. Roger. The mine has an interesting history, John. It was built by the Soviets. Officially, as a coal facility. But off the books, it was what? According to CIA reports, Soviets found uranium deposits. Mind them in secret. Uranium was pretty much depleted by the time Georgia became an independent state. The economics just weren't profitable on a commercial scale, so they closed it. Eh, it looks like it's deteriorated ever since. Ready when you are. Do not engage. Wait for my march and watch my position. I'll take care of this first guy. Watch my back. Roger.
You better hurry up, pal. Okay, I have the data. I'm out of here. Thanks, man. I'll see you around. JSON kid came through like a pro. Got a shitload of heavily encrypted intel. Some seriously important stuff. How important? Damn, Robert is as elusive as that Armazi guy. I think we would have heard if Robert was dead. For now, he and Armazi, if he exists, are in the wind. Any good news? Absolutely. Your little tanker explosion is crippled transportation of some key chemical components. Cisterns are nowhere near their destination. Cause major instability in separatist operations. We know what the cisterns are transporting? Not yet. But we did confirm previous intel about a monster load of high-tech equipment. Smuggled into the region. Not sure where it's headed. The lair. Jesus, Raquel. Are you fucking everywhere? Everywhere I need to be. I managed to slip around Lydia. And thank God I did. Interrogation of a few criminal conspirators led me to intel about where Vasiliska smuggled the high-tech weapons. Which is where? I am missing two words here. Thank you. Quite right. The weapons are headed to an old abandoned military base in the mountains. Soviet era. Vasilisk calls it his lair. You really should put more faith in me, John. Out. This is Big John. Go to the old Soviet base called the lair. I think it's the location with all the answers. Robert? All clues point in that direction. <clears throat> it's the headquarters for Amazi and his crew. If Amazi doesn't have Robert, he knows who does. No one would hold back answers from a friend like Armazi. So we're close. So close, I can smell the gun oil. I'm tired, Frank. One last big push, right? There's a ton of high-tech gear that's been shipped in there. Find it, John. And find Robert. One way or another. God bless. Out. Okay, son. Let's recap before I get any more confused. The Separatists used outside help to smuggle the weapons, gear, and material in Georgia. Yep. Then they sold the gear to local criminals. Yep. And then, Vasilis moved into the lair, and it finally disappeared. Yep. I think that's it. Christ. I'm impressed. No wonder foreign intelligence had trouble tracking that contraband. Yeah, but complicated plans have a way of fucking up. Can't control all the circumstances. Like surprise visitors dropping in the region and creating havoc? Yep, that would be us. Yeah, fine. I'll check out the tunnels. Good man. Keep me posted. I'm in, and I have a feeling I'm not alone down here. Have a look around and keep your eyes peeled. There's probably cameras down there. I found something. Two men wearing similar gear to the helmet I found after the Kazori wedding. That's a start. But we need something more concrete. See if you can find a way to swipe some footage from their CCTV system. Okay, I got the video. Get out of there. 
before they find you. Armazi has an offer. Uh, on your knees, North. Down, boy! <laughs> Not a popular decision. I prefer to shoot you now. Your brother is dead. When? How? I killed him. But he was ready to go, John. Happy to go. Torture! You son of a... Do you believe in resurrection, John? What the fuck? You monster! You're a believer, aren't you? That's what I offer. Resurrection? Yeah. You're insane. I am Armazi. Fuck! I really thought... Thank God, Robert! Come. I can explain everything. Your ears only. Turn off your earpiece. Beautiful, isn't it? You were right, John. I was bitter and lonely. I didn't believe in anything. I had nothing but doubts. Questions and doubts. Now, I have certainty. Absolute. Certainty. What did they fucking do to you? They showed me the future, brother. And I want you to join me. 23 Society is everywhere in your precious church. In your beloved Marine Corps. Right. This legendary covert international death machine is going to change the world. Oh, John. First they ignore you, then they laugh at you. Then they fight you, and then you win. You may fight us, but we will win. You're quoting fucking Gandhi to justify murdering children and drowning their parents in rivers of blood? You're a goddamn terrorist! I am one ghost warrior among many. If only the strong survive, we show the people their strength. What the fuck, Robert? It all sounds incredible, I know. When I was captured, I fought them hard. But no matter how many times I tried to escape, it was as if they could read my mind. And then, then they showed me something. Just hear me out. Special scientific enhancement. Cutting edge, unbelievable stuff. That helmet I shot out of your hands. If you held up a donut, I could have shot clean through the middle hole. Yeah, sorry, pal. But no one is that good. You see that hawk up there? No. That's why I was willing to let Robert die in order to be raised up as our mozzie. They will enhance your body and mind until you can do anything. We gotta go, boss. Let us raise you up to resurrection as one of us, John. Boss, we gotta go now! Come with me! 
Fully! Now! Bird is leaving! What did they do to you? What crazy shit did they do? I love you, brother! I thought it'll kill me. You did good. He looked me in the eyes. You did what you had to. That's how it works. You just pull this damn trigger. You kill or you get killed. That boy I beat up? He said you die up there. That you'll come back in a coffin like the soldiers on the news. I'll come back. Living and breathing, I promise. A war in Afghanistan is not enough to break apart the North, brothers. You hear me, Rob? I will always be there for you. Robert's dead. He's gone. He's resurrected. Robert's the fucking enemy. Slow down, son. He's a mozzie. Robert is a mozzie. But how? Better soldiering through science. They turned him into a 23 Society super soldier. The sniper who made the impossible shot at the wedding, that was a turbocharged Robert. Wait a minute, Robert? This whole secret society thing is real? Yeah, real as a fucking heart attack. Take a breath. Slow down. Take a breath. Take a breath. I cannot fucking breathe at all. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. 23 Society got him. Did some kind of chemical DNA mind-enhancing shit. Mixed in some high-tech super weapons and made him this... This fucking science experiment. And he's proud of it. Wanted me to join him. We've all heard rumors, but... Says they're everywhere. At the highest levels of government, the military, even the fucking marines. Says we're surrounded and don't even know it. John, we're all here. We're surrounding you. We've got your back. Lydia's right. This is a problem we can figure out. It's not a problem, Frank. It's a fucking betrayal. It's... Treason. Jonathan North. I have an assignment for you regarding your recent exploits at the lair. My man is in contact with Mr. Sims, but he needs to see you in person before he can trust you with it. I'm sending you his location. Good, I'm good. I hate to say it. No, you don't. Just get to it. I'm in no mood. We know Vasilisk was spooked by an American scoping out the quarry. That's you, John. He was freaked out enough to move Flostov to a more secure location. I quote, put him in that old lab where the engineers captured by Klosovich used to work. Flostov, that precious scientist Massa wants to recruit. 
I was wondering what the Separatists wanted with him. But now... Now I'm practically sure that he's being held by the 23 Society. Jesus. Okay. So who's this Klosovich guy? Mikhail Klosovich. Politician. Local mayor. Corrupt to the core. I think Flostov is in an old lab he used. One of those captured engineers used to walk. So Klosovich is the key. And I know where Klosovich is. Don't know if it'll be too late to save Robert. We can only try. Out. I've got eyes on the mail. Sneaky rat bastard. <coughs> He's on his way to meet Left Rapsh. Trapsh? He's in our deck. Most wanted. Mail's trailed by goons. Don't want to get in a tangle with them. Best to take Trapsh out and scare Mr. Mail Rat right back to his village. Now let the team deal with him there. Good hunting. Out. I'm climbing up the hill. I'll wait for the target from up there. Good. Be careful. The Separatists will be sure to cover sniping positions. Confirmed. Wait for my signal. Target found. He's got company, though. It's getting awfully crowded down there. We don't need civilian casualties here. Pull the trigger only when you have a clear line of sight. You can do that, right? Get back to me, John, before you make your next move. How so? I'll keep eyes on Mel Klosovich and follow him back to the village. When I can pinpoint his exact location... You let me know. No use wasting time or ammunition. Thanks, Raquel. <laughs> At last. A little politeness goes a long way, Marine. My pleasure. Out. Hello, Mr. North. This is Karigal Meshki. I'm one of Kobo's men. I'm terribly sorry to bother you, but the Rodki Lions need your help yet again. I've reached out to Miss Chodjatsa. She wanted you to meet me in person before you begin your mission. You should have my location now. Rat's in the trap, John. Right where we want him. Go get him. But not too <coughs> rough. Just a little rough? We need him alive and in good <coughs> condition. Then leave it to me to make him talk. Capture Klosovich. Interrogate him, get to Flostov, 23 Society hideout. Yeah, I got it. Out. Raquel, where are you? Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm here, North. Come on! Why am I here? What do you want from me? Come on, Mikhail. You're not that stupid, are you? You're fucking kissing a lot of 23S ass. Are you satisfied? You're going to tell us everything you know. I, I, I don't know anything. I was just a runner. I gave them guns and ammo. Sometimes I, I provided that scary-looking prick Vasilisk with companions. But that's it. You're a fucking terrible actor, Klosovich. Don't piss me Maybe, off. maybe. I heard something about some American engineers who were abducted. American engineers? Yes, non-military. They were uh, uh, repairing a dam or something, but that's all I know, I swear. Flosto! Rings a bell, doesn't it? Where is he? I I've never heard of anybody named Flostov. Fuck! It fucking hurts! Stop! Flostov! 
Dr. Sergei Raquel. Flostov. Raquel. I don't fucking know who that is. I don't fucking know who that is. I swear to God, please! Fucking liar! Shine! Stand down! Now! You know he's lying! I swear to you that I'm not lying! I cannot believe this. You can deal with this fucking mess yourself. Meet me in the next room when you're done. I don't care what you do, so long as you keep your bitch at bay. Start telling me everything you know about the 23 Society, or I'm gonna bring her back in here. No, Understand? No, no, okay, okay. I'll tell you what I know. Please, take this shit out of me. What the fuck was that? He wasn't going to talk without the proper motivation. Don't give me your bullshit about motivation. You knew damn well what you were doing. Did it not work? You do not abuse prisoners. You fucking know that. Did. It. Not. Work. A group of engineers, Americans, were taken by separatist forces not far from here. We find them, we find our way directly to 23S. That easy? That easy. See? It all worked out. You know the separatists pretty well by now, and I have an excellent understanding. Does abducting a group of civil engineers seem like a high priority separatist goal? No. No. If the separatists were involved at all, my guess is they were just a delivery service. Kidnapped to order. Perhaps for the 23 society. Yeah. Separatists blow shit up, not build shit. So what is 23 society building in addition to super soldiers? Fuck if I know. The 23 Society is key to the missing engineers. Keep your eyes open, John. I think we are getting close to what's really at stake. And damn if it doesn't keep leading back to Robert. Out. This mission is fucking important because it's about American civilian lives. I understand that, sir. And right now, securing their safety <coughs> is not our top priority. It's our <coughs> only priority. Yes, sir. But... Soldier, enough! giving you latitude. Lots of latitude. Now you will put everything else aside. Understood? Yes, sir. Understood, sir. I cannot fucking worry about Robert when I've got civilians out there. Robert is off the table. Completely off the table. That is a direct order. Out. John North, USMC. I'm here to bust you out. It's about goddamn time. Frank, I've got a couple of them. Four are confirmed missing, John. Locate the others. Copy. Wait for my signal. Chopper's inbound. Stay here, wait for my signal, and then move upstairs. Okay. Hey, where is the work stopped? Let me check. Chopper has visual on the dam. Take cover, North. Enemies inbound. Cover the engineer's escape. Get to the helo. Go, go, go! Sound the alarm. No! Separatist smuggling routes, which we did. 
We have several leads to go on. Sims is being briefed by our people as we speak. I hope this will be our last push against the Separatists. Please meet me. I have the target in my sights. Take him out. John, try not to kill him on the spot. Unless you don't mind looking for the crota on your own. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. Where's your base, fuckface? Up north. Oh. Along the river. Careful what you wish for. But at last you'll face him, without the element of supplies on his belt. You know who and what he is. You have to do it, John. It's the only way to expose 23 society. Bring it out of the shadows. Now we know who they are, and we can finally really fight them. Fuck. I finally understand the temptation of slapping a medal on someone and calling it quits. What a fucking disaster. Fuck up, Marine. You did good. The whole team. Every damn one of you. And Robert? You have no idea what he went through to get to the place he is. I loved him. I know you did. Out. Copy. Find the documentation. It should be somewhere inside. Maybe you can check one of the hard drives? Can you be more precise? Separatist reports and orders might <coughs> turn out to be a useful intel. And John, be careful. Got it. This place looks weird. Hands off the keyboard. Don't move. Turn around. Slowly. You're not from the 23 Society. I'll be the one asking questions. Technically, that wasn't a question. Don't fuck with me. Tell me where do you keep Professor Sergei Flostov, and I won't shoot you in the knee. You're speaking with him. Now, if I may, I'd like to know what do you want with me? Why are you working for them? Isn't that obvious? I have an aversion to being shot. You thought I was intentionally helping these thugs? Christ, no. They took me at gunpoint, said if I didn't help them, they'd cut me into pieces over the course of several months. What did they want from you? One of my many specializations is virology. They wanted me to develop a viral means to induce specific genetic mutations in humans. They used it to enhance the soldiers' combat capability, giving them superior strength, improved stamina, increased reflexes, and so on. How many of the soldiers did they enhance? As many as they wanted, I guess. They didn't exactly keep me in the loop. Keep talking. Recently, they also made me assist them in their psychological conditioning sessions. It seems good doctors are hard to come by in these parts. Psychological conditioning? As in brainwashing? <laughs> You've been watching too many movies, I think. No. This was more along the lines of psychological, emotional manipulation, leading their subject to reevaluate. Subject, describe him to me. Shine to north. John, come in. North. Lab is secured. I found Flostov. Good work, John. Mossad is going to be in your debt. I'm going to be in your debt. I should be there shortly. Copy that. North out. 
Tell me about the subject. Ah, uh, yes. He was strong, I, I will say that. I was glad to see him resist. What was his name? His name... Uh, I have no idea. Uh, what I can tell you is that he was uh, American. A soldier, judging by his coarse language. An older gentleman, gray Shit. hair. Shit, not Robert. When it became apparent that he wouldn't break, they took him away. Took him where? I heard the guards talking about a place called the Slaughterhouse. I suspect it's where all the prisoners go before they, well, die. Shit. Raquel, where are you? I've just entered the caves, closing in on your position. Good. I'm heading out to investigate a place called the Slaughterhouse. North out. My associate will be here shortly. Do everything she says. Raquel, report. I'm on site. Over. Thrust off's all yours. Secure facility and prevent destruction of any equipment. Copy. Out. Over to you, John. Ah, uh, scout more of the area. Better safe than sorry. Abort. Urgent rescue of American soldier being held at the slaughterhouse now with top priority. You can leave Flost off to Raquel. Get our guy out. Copy that. Out. Proceed directly to the slaughterhouse. On my way. Good chance that prisoner's still alive. He's one of ours. In any case, we leave no man behind. Copy that, Marine. You'll head directly to the slaughterhouse. Keep your eyes open and expect heavy resistance. Stay focused. Just get our guy and leave the area. Do you copy? Confirmed. 23 Society is many things, but they're not stupid. They're always well fucking prepared. I'll stay alert. Out. Watch out, Marine. The whole place is monitored with the CCTV system. Try to hack their servers first. Will do. Fuck. What? I found the doors to the basement, but it's locked. I'll have to find the key card to sneak in. I'd blow the doors with the explosives if I were you. Well, yeah. They didn't know I was here before. I sure as hell do now. Okay, you're in the basement. That's the main thing. Please help us. Get us out of here. The lock is rusted to the no core. promises. Should break if I give it a little force. Thank you, sir. Don't forget about Okay, us. you're free. Wait for things to calm down a little, and then run for your lives. Thank you. We are forever in your debt. Save your strength, Cole. I'm gonna get you out of here. They injected me with something. I I can barely remember. There was a man. He had a soothing voice. He talked to me. Tried to explain. I when when I didn't give them what they wanted. They had Robert bring me here to die. Like an animal. Who was this man? Who did this to you? Their leader. Sergei Flostov. What? Raquel, can you hear me? Raquel, you're in danger. Flostov is leading 23 society. Raquel. Fuck. I have to... No. I'm broken, kid. Broken beyond repair. Help me die with dignity.
Raquel, come in. Raquel? Vostov here. Where's Raquel? How did you access this channel? She's unavailable at the moment. I have allowed myself to talk with you, Mr. Booth. Where is Raquel? Where her talent can be enhanced, her strength magnified, where she can become the super soldier she was destined to be. It's you. It's been you all along. Yes, indeed. I am 23 Society. You're a very poor judge of character, John. Honest men can be so very calm. Where have you got her? Right where she belongs. A fine physical specimen. She's in peak condition, as was your brother. Perhaps we have our first breeding pair. We'll find wide-hipped peasant surrogates. Raquel is too superb a fighting machine to ruin her physique. That's a travesty! They... That's science. A combination of eugenic selective surgery, DNA enhancement, and mental manipulation. The program is precisely tailored to the individual. Too bad we don't have such an effective tool as Mila. What the fuck does Mila have to do with it? We put Mila's death to excellent use with Robert. We killed her, of course. Her recorded screams and the words we forced her to say very effective. Robert thought he was losing his mind. We gave it back to him slightly. Oh, God. We'll manage something effective with Raquel. Perhaps we'll even use you. Raquel is surprisingly attached to you, John. Meanwhile, Amazi, your very skillful brother, has made your friend call into a belly breathing meat sack, and he did it with such enthusiasm. I will end you. But first, you'll have to find me. And by then, it will be too late. Lights out, John. Out. 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 Fucking bastard. We need to find her as soon as possible. Go over every detail. Reach out to everyone. I have my network here. See what I can do. Out. This is bad, John. Really bad. Fuck. What now? We've got Raquel's location from the defector. But that's good. She's at the silo, John. Very secure facility, under heavy guard. Must be a very high value asset for them. You know why? Yeah, it's despicable. We had our differences, but I'm really sorry. Nah, she's a fighter. She can just hold out. The 23 Society have turned the silo into a fortress. It's ultra secure. You will need support. I'll check out every possible way through. We'll get her back. I'll think of something. Out. There are a lot of patrols around here. I recommend you take the hills. What about you? I'm going to scout ahead. Copy that. I'll be careful, by the way. Thanks for your concern. Uh, I just figured caution would go without saying. Now the back of this complex is less guarded. That's where we'll strike. Classic backstab in action. Got it.
Yeah, I see. All right, I'm heading into the base. Take down those snipers on the silos. Getting more interesting by the hour. A patrol is coming. Shit, I need to hide. It stopped. Kill the driver. I'll kill the driver. I'll take the passenger. I almost forgot how impressive you are. We're running out of time. I'm going on ahead. Tag the hostiles, will you? I guess I should say something. So, thanks for saving my ass, both of you. Are you all right, Raquel? I'm fine, John. Lucky. Flostov wanted me unscathed. In the end, they gave me more than they got for me. How did you manage that? Trade secret. Also, men are dumb around pretty girls. That's because they think with their dicks. What did you learn? The 23 Society is hunting a separatist leader calling herself the Black Widow. Flostov wants her badly. Did they say why? I assume she has information that Flostov doesn't want getting out of the country. We have to find her before the Society does. First we need to find out who this Black Widow is. Ina Zakarayan. The woman from Kazori? The bride? That's the one. You know where she is? Nothing for certain. Though I would imagine after seeing her husband being gunned down, she went into hiding. Once we're out of here, I'll be able to press my contacts for more information. Let's not waste any time. 
purpose of is to Ina Zakarayan. The widowed bride. I'd tell you to use your considerable charm to gain her trust, but 23 society may just scare you away regardless. They want her dead. Then she must know something important about 23 society. Something on Flostov. Or oh, Amazi. I'll find her and get what we need to close in on Flostov. And Amazi. Time is running out. I'm ready to put an end to this. We all are. Out. I'm in the house. Listen, I know how this looks, but today, I'm your friend. Why the fuck should I trust you? Because right now, Ina is not a threat. Unlike the boss of the guys who nearly killed you. I can't get to him unless I talk with her. Understand? How quickly things change, huh? Alright, she's hiding at the ruins behind the village. But don't tell her I told you. I appreciate your help. Stay low for now. Don't shoot! Don't let them know we're here! I'm not here to kill you. I need to talk to Ina. Yeah, that's not happening. I don't have time nor patience for this bullshit. Where is she? Fuck! She's, she's in the basement, okay? There are some mean sons of bitches looking for her, so she stays put. Well, get ready to kill them, because I need to talk to her. Today. Oh yeah? If you are who I think you are, fuck it. It's worth a shot. Head on in. Get ready, get on the road. Get ready, get on the road. Time for me to have a chat with Black Widow. Ina Zakarayan. You made your masters proud today, Mr. North. Now what? And please. You're smart enough not to believe that cliché enemies of my enemies are my friends bullshit. So don't expect my gratitude. I don't. I want something from you. Get on with it then. I've got a double-dealing motherfucker to kill and a war to win. I want to know where Armazi is hiding. <laughs> if you have a death wish, spare yourself the trouble and just put a bullet in your head. Look around. You owe me your life. Should I take it as a threat? No need to answer, Mr. North. I can see the answer in your eyes. Fine. I'll tell you where Armarcy is, if you kill David for me. He's an ally to your cause. Why would you don't want him dead? Don't play dumb, You think I don't know who ordered my husband killed? Who ordered me killed? If I do this for you, and you fuck me over... I've seen what you can do. Trust me when I say I want to have as little to do with you as possible. It is responsible for Thomas's death. Almost like Cain and Abel, isn't it? And twins, too. No closer tie, they say. According to Ina, David sold out Thomas for the promise of power. Amazi told David what to do, and David did it. So David thinks Amazi will put him in charge? David planned to unify all the separatists into an unbeatable army funded and equipped by 23 Society. Leaving David the grand, exalted ruler at the end of it. According to what Ina believes, she says David's danger can't be overestimated. His termination would leave the Separatists leaderless. And fuel infighting. And all sorts of internal power grabbing. Leave the Separatists in complete chaos. JSOC's already put the order out. Without David's contacts and know-how, it will sever the Separatists' link with the society. Cut off the remaining head of the double-headed serpent. And let the tail thrash around without purpose. 
Simon's barricaded in the old Horizon Hotel. Yeah, I know where that is, near the mining town. If you can, get to David and eliminate him. It will draw Robert out. I don't envy you, John. He's the enemy, plain and simple. Out. Thanks for reminding me of the obvious. Leave heavy water just sloshing around, right? Backup plan was centrifugal separators, but that wasn't a big success either. Too much scrambling around for not the right parts. Frank here. Logs gathered by the JSOC agent you saved were finally decrypted. Flostoff is making yellow cake. We're talking nuclear disaster of the first magnitude. Only option is to take out Flostov and his lieutenants in a clean strike. Correct. Without 23 society training and funding, the Separatists become squabbling little local warlords. With Davi gone, Separatists are already dividing up. And with Flostoff gone, JSOC's mission is accomplished. Robert could still be a high-value asset. Let me... That's a no, from the highest level. You can't expect me to... No! That is a direct order from top command. Out. This is it, people. Do or die. Is everybody ready? About as ready as I'm going to be. Can the melodrama and get on with it? I took the liberty of pulling some intel on the facility you're about to storm. It's a Soviet-era uranium mine. Been abandoned since the early 90s. Do we know what to expect? Once you're inside, no clue. All things considered, though, I would expect heavy resistance. So what's the plan? If you put me on a ridge with a clear line of sight, I can cover your infill exfil. Once they notice you're inside, they'll call for reinforcements. I can make sure their comms will be as dead as your social life. Was that a joke? Whoa, she does have a personality. I will shoot you both. John, you'll make your way inside. You know what to do from there. Find Flostov, subdue him, and bring Robert home. John, you know it's not going to be that easy. If Robert won't cooperate, you'll have to... I will bring Robert home, Frank. Roger that. All right. We all know what we're doing, John. It's your call. But I wouldn't wait with this one forever. Let's finish this as soon as possible. Sims out. Keep comms open. I'll call when the time is right. To sum up, your mission is to infiltrate the mining facility, where we hope you'll find both Robert and Sergei. Expect heavy resistance from both the Separatists and 23S goons. Me and Raquel will move up <coughs> first to scout the area. Maintain radio contact. The mining facility is split into two parts, the top and the bottom tunnels. Once you find a way to get underground, you're on your own. We'll try and cover your escape routes. Use all your skills, John. Look around and use the environment. I'll be overseeing you with the full support of JSOC real-time satellite imagery. The big boys have finally rolled out their expensive toys. All right, people. Let's finish this. I'm in position. Over. I'm ready to. John, while scouting, I've noticed a guy leaving the elevator and locking it with his keycard. You'll need to get this card for me to get a ride on the ground. This complicates things. Okay, okay, focus. The guy with the keycard has to be there somewhere. Look around for some kind of a leader. I'm on site. I can see the top of the mine. Good. Try to obtain this elevator keycard from their leader. There might be an alternative entrance somewhere. Make sure to look around.
I found the man with the key card. Got it. Go grab it. Start talking. Your target's over there. Search the perimeter. I'm inside. Be careful in there. We'll cover the exits for as long as you need. Good luck, man. Just inside the enemy. What the hell? Voltage. At least one of the generators exploded. This whole makeshift installation is falling apart. That explosion disabled the reactor cooling system. You're sitting on a fucking time bomb. How much time? Minutes? Hours? No idea. Jesus! Fuck! Reactor core unstable. What's going on? The reactor is unstable. It's reaching the meltdown point. I need to shut it down. All right. This is now your priority objective. Robert and Sergey will have to wait. I'm going in to support John. Negative. This is too dangerous. Try to stop me. I said no. <coughs> Critical. John, I'll be there in a minute. Don't do anything rash. Automatic shutdown attempt failed. Do you not hear the alarms, Robert? The reactor is going critical. Then shut it down. The only way to prevent the meltdown now is going in there. And that's so I'm not leaving until I finish this. Finish what? The reactor is minutes away from filling this entire mine with lethal amounts of radiation. It's All already the more finished. reason for him to join us. I couldn't Damn help it. but notice that you were talking about me. It's not too late, John. You can still join us. Will you listen to yourself? The 23 Society are terrorists. They fight for a better world. God damn it, Rob. They're using you. Haven't you ever wondered what happened to Mila? He's trying to manipulate you, Robert. They killed her, Rob. The 23 Society wanted to break you, to tear you down to nothing, and reshape you in their image. Mila died of radiation poisoning after that drone fiasco in the Congo. We tried to save her. She died in your arms, There's never Robert. been a U.S. drone strike in Congo. Vlasov kidnapped and poisoned her himself. All this is just to break you. He calls such an event the pillar. I can prove it, Rob. Sergei? He's trying to manipulate you. Robert North is dead. Is it true? You are Armazi of the 23 Society. And is it true? Yes. The death was a necessary evil. We had to free you from your old life, Robert. Robert, they took her from me. They took everything from me. Rob, we need to go. I can't. I can't. It's too late anyway. Then let's at least die trying to escape. You're right. Okay. You're right. Okay, let's go. I'm sorry, John. Say hi to mom for me. Rob! John, are you all right? Rob! Rob, what the John, hell are you thinking? John! He'll die! He'll die! He's already dead. I'm sorry, but it's true. I'm so sorry. Rob! Should be safe. Go home, John. Come on, John. 
It's time to leave. You'll be back at base soon. ETA 17 minutes. Copy. You did well, Mr. North. It was a privilege to walk alongside you. What will you do now? I'm going to find them all. The society. I'm going to find them. And make them pay.